The University College Hospital, UCH Ibadan, says it will champion training in radiology informatics in the West African region for precise and effective healthcare delivery in diseases such as cancer. The new UCH Chief Medical Doctor, Professor Jesse Otebayo, made the pledge in Ibadan during the opening of the new radiology reporting room. This is the kind of thing that keeps into our vision as management because not only will this program help in the treatment of our patients in intervention radiology, I mean there are some treatment models that you need to do surgery and all that. Now with interventional the radiology and by injecting certain things and all that, I don't know much about radiology, so permit my friend, you may not need to take the patient to surgery. So it's going to up our game in clinical practice. And that is not the only thing. This institution has a tripartite function of training, research, and clinical services. This center, as I learned, will become a kind of training center for not just Nigeria, probably the whole of Western. And this hospital is going to turn to a mecca of sorts for training, which is part of what I think that this hospital will really be, because we are the first in this country. We want to maintain that role and even surpass whatever has happened in the past in the name of our glory. Uh, unfortunately, things went down because of neglect of the hospital, but we thank God that things are moving in the right direction and a better direction. The opening of the room was made possible through a partnership of the Territory Institution with Rad Aid International, a U.S.-based non-profit organization. The director of Rad Aid Nigeria, Dr. Farouk Dako, said radiology informatics helps clinicians to have immediate electronic access to medical images, saves precious time, costs, and allow timely medical decision by reducing unnecessary repetition of examinations. A, a huge part of deciding what is in front of you is getting the whole story, right? So you can't get the whole picture if you don't have the prior images. You can't get the whole picture if you don't have advanced ways of looking at these images. So from that standpoint, yes, you know, we can hopefully provide better care to our patients now that we have this sort of system that, that helps us do that. In addition, it makes the job of the radiologist easier. And you know, that's an important piece of them being able to perform at their peak performance as well. So yeah, so this is, this is one step in that direction. We definitely see UCH as our partners. We have a partnership agreement. So we, we definitely never plan on only engaging them once. This is only the beginning. And based on how successful we have been early on, we, I, I, I foresee a, a, a bright future in, in our partnership. As a matter of fact, as you, you might or might not know, we have a, another team coming next week, which is bringing a different um, set of, of skill set. They're interventional radiologists. They're doing a symposium with plans on having the first interventional radiology training program in Nigeria. So I'm not going to talk too much about that because there's a lot more people coming next week and I want them to be able to, to get the chance to um, talk to you guys as well. This wouldn't be, po be possible if UCH already wasn't committed to this, right? So UCH has the correct kind of infrastructure that is necessary to take this next step. As a matter of fact, they've already been trying to take this step themselves. So we just came over here to help out in, in, in any way that we could, and we, we have been successful so far. We've been able to connect some, some modalities, some of their x-rays and, and CT scans and MRIs to a more centrally located place where it can be saved and it can be archived whenever it's needed. So patients no longer have to walk around with their films they never have to worry about where their films went to, you know, the hard copies and the films, and we can store it, we can store it for them. And, and we, whenever they come back, we can see the images even from years before, all stored on the computer.